Hello Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. We're going to be taking a look at what is manifesting for you at this moment. What is going on in your current situation with you and the person that is on your mind. Whenever you come across this reading will be the right time for you to see it. And as always, take what resonates and leave out the rest. If by the end of this reading, you're still needing some more messages or confirmation, you can always take a look at your other placements. And if you're interested in a personal reading done by myself, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all. Okay. Aquarius, I'm seeing that in what is passing you, you have taken some time to leave conflict in the past. I'm seeing things have started to progress for you. Um, you've been moving on from something um, that has been a challenging and you're, you've been going towards a new destination, peaceful waters. Um, I'm hearing a better opportunity. We do have the clock. So Something has taken a lot of time, say a lot of time for you to finally move forward here. I'm seeing we have the clock. Need time takes time and time cycles, time to heal and progress. So again, progress. Things have been progressing. Um, I'm seeing that there's someone who you've been moving forward with. You two have wanted to leave the past in the past. And you have given your time, energy, and you've invested into this situation. You've been giving to this emotionally as well. So you're following your heart here. The way that you're seeing someone is as the world. So you see this person as your world. Um, someone who you want to take the next steps with, you want another chapter with them, distance, far away, six of swords. So there could be traveling towards seeing this person to could live at a distance. I'm seeing right now, there is something has, there's something that has changed. Because I see that we do have the coffee cup, a meeting or conversation, savoring the moment, feeling uplifted and friendship, a conversation that didn't go the way that you hoped. Strength card reversed. I'm seeing that you're, you feel weak or you feel like you don't have what it takes to overcome this challenge you no longer you don't have the willpower or the ter determination because things are moving way too slow for you and your intentions here is to put something to an end put an ending because you're no longer seeing you're no longer feeling hopeful or optimistic about this situation anymore it's like you don't have the desire anymore to keep fighting for this. You're wanting to focus on your success. Two of Cups, a breakup. Wow. At one point you saw this person as your world. And now it's just... 
things have gotten out of control. A breakdown in communication. I see you barely talking to this person. Um, but I see them coming towards you with a love offer. They're communicating with you. And they're trying to talk to you. Wanting to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Doing something little to see how you react. And you're not reacting. Like you just don't have the willpower anymore. We have the Five of Swords. They're devastated. I'm saying they're they're upset. They feel like they are losing you. We have not today, not dealing, hurt, avoiding a conversation, call our person, boundary still angry still angry. They feel um like you're still angry at them. You're avoiding them. You're not uh, accepting their apology. But their their intentions towards you coming forward is the Knight of Cups. So they are wanting to apologize for something. And they're wanting to try to show you love. They want to make a proposal for you. They're following their heart. But I don't see them coming towards you because you're avoiding them. They see you as, oh yeah, Four of Swords, the Hanged Man. They see you as taking a break, um, needing time to think about things, uh, or waiting. You're okay. You're waiting. I see patience. The, you're you're waiting right now. You're giving something time to think about whether or not you want to put an ending to this. So instead of putting an ending right away you're taking time to think about whether or not this is something that you want to do you're waiting it out looking for a different perspective or an epiphany moment more clarity they see you as distant I see you really working on trying to free yourself or other people from something. We do have healthy choices. So um, making healthy choices in love and in life, self-love, self-care, and being happier. In the next few weeks, I see you being happier. I see that you are letting go of a burden. This burden that you're letting go of um, is going to get you out of that place where you have been feeling overwhelmed eight of coins you're you're focused on your your work and your career you could be getting over someone by working a lot but the main focus is what i'm seeing is your security Queen of Coins, focusing on yourself um, and overall trying to make better choices. You're really working hard and trying to prove yourself. Someone here is not giving up Nine of Wands, but I see them really exhausted in this situation and you've completely like, you are, you've given up on it cycles cycles it's like an on and off cycle that you can no longer you just don't have the willpower anymore to keep this going we have justice in your outcome so it's a decision justice you have justice in your outcome so it's a win situation for you but this means getting out of this can mean a divorce, a breakup, but I do feel like this is someone who you've been with for a very long time. Someone's losing hope. Losing faith. Because I do see you taking all things into consideration and making a fair outcome. You are being fair. You can't, you know, we can't keep repeating cycles and 
expecting different results. You're making a decision where I see you, you know, just focusing on on yourself and your career, your hard work. Your hard you're working really hard on something, but I see you definitely taking things slow. You're interested in new love. We have um, the palm tree, so I do see in your outcome you have stability and security for yourself um, when it comes to your finances, permanence, growth, endurance, flexibility. This decision that you're making is you're open to you're open to uh, a new love, King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio, someone new who you end up meeting. But I see you taking things slow and I see that there's someone new who is interested in you. This is very interesting. You could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. You could have Leo in your chart somewhere. Let's get some specifics and details for you. like you've tried to move past something but you can't keep doing the same thing over and over again it just doesn't work like that I completely understand we have coffin in your past so this is telling me like something should have ended a long time ago this could be with a main male so someone who you were in a relationship a male who you were in a relationship main person there could be something legal legal matter a legal case that ends up going your way in the outcome a decision being made that is justice for you someone is really concerned worried over your decision um, but again like in the next few weeks i see you working really hard to free yourself making better choices. The numbers I'm seeing is 19, 1, 31, 29, and 33. Let's see what Spirit wants you to know right now, Aquarius. I'm hearing, you, this is gonna be very cryptic, but it's like, either you're trying to free yourself or you're trying to free other people by working really hard on getting something done. Whatever that means for you. Someone could literally be in prison. Imprisonment and justice judic judication here. What does Spirit want you to know right now? Nothing will come out of this situation. Yeah, I, I'm seeing like... You already know that. What do you need to release? Spirit is asking you to release something. Um, a, a personal issue for you will reach a resolution, full moon and cancer, and it's going to be a fair outcome for you. So justice is on your side here. The truth is going to come out. Um, you could have cancer in your chart. You could be dealing with a cancer. But with that being said, this is what I'm seeing. If it resonated with you, let me know in the comment section down below. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Bye.